<laughs> All right, uh, MVP, doing your career with the face, probably the biggest names in the business at the time. Yeah. The Undertaker, John Cena, Kane, giants such as the Big Show, the Great Khali, and so on and so forth. Um, out of those, um, who was your favorite opponent? Not necessarily in the Undertaker. The, the Great Khali was my least favorite opponent because he sucks bad. Um, you know, people all the time ask me, who is your favorite opponent? And to answer that, I say like, man, what was your favorite slice of pizza? Or, you know, what was your favorite ice cream? So I can say, because as you said, I've been so fortunate. You know, I had an amazing feud with Matt Hardy, one of the best minds in wrestling. Um, Chris Benoit was my mentor, one of the technical master. Um, of course, The Undertaker, who is you know, a wrestling god. So it's difficult to say who my favorite was, but I will say, uh, emotionally, it was very cool to have wrestled Ric Flair twice in my career in angles. And the first time, I was honored that in Toyota, I mean, uh, in Houston at the Toyota Center, when I was the United States champion with this title right here, Ric Flair challenged me for the title. And I beat Ric Flair to defend the United States Championship. And uh, is there anybody here who doesn't know Ric Flair? Raise your hand. Okay. Ric Flair famously said, to be the man, I beat the man. That makes me the man. So that's pretty cool. And then at Madison Square Garden, I got a chance to wrestle Ric Flair. Madison Square Garden, the most famous arena in the world. And the significance of that match was at the Royal Rumble. And the idea was that when Flair lost his match, he had to retire. And maybe some of you remember him facing Shawn Michaels at WrestleMania. And <laughs> say goodnight, right? But for me, on that journey, I got to wrestle the Nature Boy Ric Flair at Madison Square Garden. And while I had performed at Madison Square Garden a few times, maybe you might remember uh, me and Matt Hardy with you back at Holyfield and you know, some other things, but... Switch up contest. Yeah, but that wasn't at Madison Square Garden. <laughs> uh, I had the honor of facing Ric Flair in my very first actual match at Madison Square Garden and Ric Flair's last match at Madison Square Garden. And that night I tapped out to the figure four and it was an honor to do that. So I probably put that up there as it's definitely one of my favorites. All right, definitely a round of applause for the nature of Ric Flair. Thank you.